Hey guys, so we are 12 weeks out and today I'm like all dressed up, kind of trying because we are trying, because today I have a lot of connections or like meeting people today for possibly like a career or an internship, so that's exciting. But it definitely feels weird wearing like button up shirts. I feel restricted. I'm gonna make some breakfast and I'm gonna take you guys with me today. And I wanted to talk to you guys about something that is on my mind, but we will talk about that later. See you guys in the next clip. And that is starting a new series pertaining to gymnastics. So a lot of my viewers were gymnastics viewers or followers or did gymnastics. So I wanna kinda of get back into doing more gymnastics tutorials. I know I have my journey to the stage vlogs. I do like normal videos. Um, but I really have been missing my gymnastics and doing gymnastics type videos. So today in the workout, I will be showing you guys how to improve your handstand. And whether you are in CrossFit, whether you're a gymnast, all of these things I'm going to show you should help you. So I've been wanting to do gymnastics tutorials like that. Um, I've been thinking about doing like a handstand bridge kickover tutorial or increasing your flexibility tutorial or the guy has the coolest beard ever or uh, just like shoulder flexibility how to deal with muscle soreness any sorts of gymnastics type tutorials please let me know what you would want because I miss doing them so I do have a trampoline at home but funny story I tried to shovel snow off of it and I cut the tarp so I've been wanting to buy a new tarp for my trampoline so I could do some videos on there and um, yeah I just I feel like you guys miss them and I miss doing them um, and of course it's still fitness like gymnastics is a hard sport so today we'll be working on our handstands so I hope you guys enjoy this and enjoy a series that I might start of doing this of like just a gymnastics tutorial so tell me what you guys think I know that was a lot of talking I am driving to, well, I'm not driving right now, that's dangerous, but I'm about to drive to the gym right now. I am on low carb this week because I'm trying to lose some weight, and my weight in this morning was 129.8, so we're doing very low carb, which is super fun. So I am having a little bit of caffeine in a Rockstar Recovery drink. I have these on rare occasion, no more than like twice a week, so don't freak out. And there's like no sugar in it whatever whatever you do and say on the internet is wrong anyway so I'm gonna drink this I'm probably not going to die so don't comment down below saying I'm gonna die for and drinking it for drinking an energy drink which isn't even that high in caffeine so see you at the gym all right guys so here are a couple of my tips on how to improve your handstand and tip number one is to find a plate and right here I'm using a 25 pound plate and I'm basically doing shoulder shrugs. You'll notice that my elbows aren't really bending and I'm trying to keep my head in a neutral position. So what that means is I'm not looking up at the ceiling or towards the floor. And this is basically a perfect handstand position. Uh, not the slouching part when the plate is down, that's not good, but the pressing up. When you do a handstand, you want to be pushing up against the surface and the plate kind of gives you the idea of that push. And then right here, I'm doing a walk up handstand. You want to place your hands down on the floor and walk your feet up the wall. And as you feel more comfortable with being upside down, walk your hands in toward the wall as you walk your feet up the wall. I hope that wasn't too confusing, but basically this will give you the idea of a handstand without being scared that you're going to kick the wall too hard or fall down. Um, this is just a very good beginning step. And right here I'm showing you a lot of issues that people face and that is keeping their head in a neutral position. So you want to keep your head in this position. Um, but not this one, this is not good at all. So it's important to keep your neck safe. And yeah, so here, if you guys are feeling a little nervous about kicking your feet up a wall, 
you can just place your feet up onto a elevated surface that is similar to a push-up position and remember folks we are doing proper push-up position this is not it you gotta push down on that floor and lift your booty up and keep your back nice and flat so one other variation of this that I absolutely love is walking your hands in closer to the block and this gives you the idea of having your upper body in that vertical handstand position without worrying about without having your feet feel like they're all overhead and you're gonna fall and get hurt um, that's what we're trying to avoid here and then right here I'm just doing a basic handstand against the wall this is a great tool to use um, for basically any level beginner intermediate advance and this just helps increase your strength remember to not keep your back all archy and gross keep your back nice and flat against the wall neutral head and straight legs I'm demonstrating the um, reverse handstand and walking your hands in towards the wall this is great for beginners and a good tool to use so after a couple of those drills I would recommend just trying out your handstand or if you're feeling a little fearless go ahead and just try your handstand without doing any of those drills but that the drills are designed to help improve your handstand and improve your upper body strength make sure when you're doing these handstands you cover your arms by your ears I, I just previously showed how not to do it so don't comment down below about that one but keep your arms by your ears in a lunge position and just kick up into a handstand I'm warning you guys right now I took like the tiniest bit off of this little bar thing which that's kind of what it looks like like a cookie don't ever buy this because it's extremely addictive and it's really hard not to eat the entire thing so this is really really good if you guys are just living life but I should not have bought it because now I'm addicted alright guys so I hope you enjoy enjoyed can I talk I hope you guys enjoyed today's video um, and you liked the handstand tutorial or walkthrough or whatever you want to call it and um, yeah 12 weeks out I believe and 12 more to go so I'm looking forward to the journey and I hope you guys are liking the footage so far bye guys